How's it going my fellow reefers? March here, Fragbox TV. We just sold this product the other day and then that's what inspired me to do today's video because we don't sell a ton of these and I think it's a great idea for any reefer really. It is a battery backup. I think this is an awesome idea if you're looking to preserve your reef tank go out and get one of these. Most people buy these after the fact. And we've actually been losing power here in the store intermittently um, once every two weeks. That's because we have uh, a stupid owner named March who doesn't know how amperage and voltage works and I'm overloading the circuits. So today's project was actually moving around plugs and calculating you know, step by step how much voltage I'm drawing from each individual socket because we're blowing the breaker in the store. If any of you were here on Saturday, we did that corals and coffee. Thank you very much to everyone who showed up. That was a great, great success. Um, hope you enjoyed the coffee and the donuts. There's one left which I'm about to destroy after this video. It might be stale. I don't really care. It's Krispy Kremes, but it was a lot of fun. Hope you guys got some good early Black Friday deals. I'm going to talk about battery backups in one more second. I have two Red Sea Reefers, the 250s here. Stupid price. I'm not even allowed to say the price in the video. It's so cheap. It's that exact tank that we're running there where we did our new Aquascape. That's our Red Sea Reefer 250 that's acro dominated. Anyways, I have just the pair left here, one in black and one in white, like Oreos, like Domino's. Come pick them up, ridiculous price. Uh, call us if you want the price or email you. I guarantee, I don't promise things. I, I never promise things. I, I, you know, I can make um, assumptions and I can say 99% of the time, I promise you, you're not gonna find a better deal on a Red Sea Reefer 250. These two, they're in my way. Come get them. I'm not sure why I'm kicking them. They're just in the middle of our small store. So anyways, that was a pretty good long-winded sidetrack and a sales plug. We keep losing power here in the store. I cannot run battery backups here because there's just simply too much to run. Like on a regular reef tank, you have something like this at home. What I would recommend doing is putting your return pump on this one and why I like the ice cap is because this one is universal. Ecotec makes one as well. Ecotec Marine, what's up back there? They make a great one. It is quite expensive, but it's only going to run their pumps. This one by ice cap is about half the price. It runs 175 Canadian. I know a lot of you are in the US, so check out BRS. I can't believe I'm sending business to another company. It's because I love them and I can't I can't sell these to you if you're in the States. We only sell them here in Canada. It's very cost effective and you can plug in just about anything. It's universal, so it's going to work with whatever power head you're currently using or just about all of them. Double check. It comes with a bunch of little adapters and it's a really great idea because in the event when, not if, when, because everyone loses power eventually. If you know how it works. At some point in time, the power is going to go off and that is very important for your reef tank. We don't want to lose power and the most important thing I would say is the flow. You don't want the water stagnant. If this pa loses power, uh, God forbid, we are going to lose our filtration because we have our pump here in the back. So the water is going to become stagnant, the corals are going to be sitting still and then we're going to lose uh, heat as well. It wouldn't be feasible to put everything on a battery backup. I guess it could be. Yeah, I guess you could go out and get a big like uh, UPC that you run a computer off of. But great, great investment, and I find that we don't sell enough of them. People will typically only buy this battery backup after a power outage. So let's say in the summer or whenever we have a huge storm here in Toronto and the whole city loses power, we're selling these like nonstop. People are very reactive and not proactive. So I know it sounds weird to go out and spend $170 for something that might happen in the future. It's going to happen and it's a small price to play, pay, sorry, not to play, a small price to pay. It acts as a piece of insurance for your tank and it keeps that pump going. And you want that because the pump, your return pump, is like the heart of your tank. If you think about the water as the blood that's transferring the heat and the oxygen and filtering and keep just like the body. So we're gonna think of the pump as the heart. And if the heart stops, not very good. I don't need to be a doctor to tell you that. What is going on with this Blasto? Oh man, not very happy. Mm, sorry, Mr. Blasto, I gotta figure out what's going on there. I'm gonna put some battery backups on here. I've always wanted to do, I've seen someone do it online on Reef Central, either Reef to Reef or Reef Central, one of the big forums, but he hooked up battery, car batteries and inverters and he shows you how to do it. Way, 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 way smarter than I am, but I'm gonna try and copy him to see if I can get this system on a battery backup kind of system that will 
take over in the event of a power outage, it switches over right to the battery, um, the car batteries. That's not feasible for most people. We have lots and lots of money running in this system, which ties into the farm in the basement. Just wanted to do a quick video today on the battery backups, and I think we'll wrap. Yeah, I think we'll wrap this one up because we'll be back here tomorrow with another reef related topic. What do you think, Mr. Diggs? Yeah? Oh, he's about tired. Can you imagine? He lives with me. He listens to me talk all day long. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to subscribe because we will be back here tomorrow with another topic. He's a very nice dog. Some people are afraid of him. You shouldn't be. This is an angel on earth. Good boy and good night.